we're back. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, my next, uh, my next guest is the co-captain of the Tampa Bay Buccaneers cheerleading squad. She's also a probation officer for the state of Florida. Please welcome the beautiful and very tough Lee Killian. Thank you for wearing your outfit. <laughs> I was hoping she would wear the cheerleading uniform <laughs> instead of the parole uniform. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's right. Oh, should I? Is this for me? Yes, is this a we have. You are an honorary member of the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Oh, that's great. Thank you very much. You're very welcome. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a Patriots fan. Oh. Uh, there now. We'll talk about that. Uh, hey, 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 hey! Boo me? No snacks. Uh, <laughs> Thank you for what this is. Uh, obviously, this is the cheerleading this outfit. This is the uniform. You, you're extremely beautiful. Thank, Thank you, you for being here. Thank Very you. attractive. You are um, too. Oh, <laughs> well. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> um, now, obviously, this is you, you would never wear something like this in your probation job, no, right? No, obviously, no. what what are you wearing when you're the probation officer? Well, you know what most people wear to work. We'll have on, you know, just some pants. Just Button-down shirt. I usually have on my gear, so right. I have a belt on. What is your gear? Do you actually carry weapons? We, you ha we have pepper spray. I have a gun. Um, handcuffs. Anything. Phone, cell phone. Anything you might need in those. So you carry a gun. Are you, yes. are you pretty good with a gun? I am. I, 47 out of 48. I was almost top gun in my academy class. 47 out of 48. Shots. Okay. Fine. Not at people, but at, no. at, at targets, yeah. <laughs> at the little... I killed 47 out of 48. <laughs> Were the, they doing uh, anything? The, no, little, the um... little blue man on the... the... Right, gotcha. Yeah. Now, uh, but you would never uh, carry the gun while you were in the outfit. For some reason, that's kind of a turn no, on to me. Uh, no, no. I haven't done that. I haven't needed it at any games or anything. Now, uh, let's talk about this. This is serious. You, uh, actually, your job is to work uh, very uh, closely with felons, people yes. who've uh, done time, usually, right? Your job yes. is to check up on them. Make sure right. that they're on, uh, that they're following the rules right. of their probation. They right? have the judge gives them community service, um, any kind of treatment that they might be, you know, to take care of while they're on probation. I'm making sure they're doing that. Can uh, a parolee request you if no. someone? Do you know what I mean? <laughs> can someone who's committed no. a crime and they need a probation officer, can they have, can I have Lee Killian, no. please, please? No? Unfortunately, no, they can't. Um, my offenders are all violent offenders. They've committed a violent offense and they're on felony probation. So they don't get a choice. But are you, that's a scary job then. Are you worried when you go to someone's house? I mean, are you, do you have backup with you when you sometimes, go to the house? Sometimes I'll go with another officer. I'll go with a male officer if I feel threatened if I'm going into a bad neighborhood or something like that. Okay. But. Do you feel fairly confident that if you got into a physical situation, you could uh, take care of yourself? I think so. Um, like I said, I do carry pepper spray. There's mm -hmm. certain precautions that we take when we're with offenders. Um, mm -hmm. We stand a certain distance away from them. Um, right. It's called the interview stance. Um, there, you know, I, and if someone were to come at me, I could push them to the side and possibly get my pepper spray if I felt threatened. Right. Yeah, so you could probably rip my head off right now <laughs> if I came at you, which we won't can do. Can I see you in your interview stance? <laughs> yes, you can. <laughs> Well, you stand. <laughs> if you were, if you were, idea, to him. I want to see oh, okay. it from that angle. Well, stand. If yeah. you okay. were, <laughs> all right. Where do you if, want me? I'm, if, I'm where? If you were so the I'm offender. So I'm like a guy. I'm a badass. Right. Right. I'm Conan O'Brien, and I'm wanting for you know some real bad stuff, and I come to the front door of my trailer. Okay? And I'm gonna. <laughs> Just I'm imagining gonna, it's a trailer. I'm gonna say hi, Mr. O'Brien. How's it going? Yeah, it's going all right. What's all going right. on? And then I get a little close. And then I would back up, and there usually is not a up. table. <laughs> <laughs> There's usually, I would back up. If I felt threatened, I would ask you to stop. Stay back, right. I would say. What if I don't? I'm like, hey, what are you going to do about it? I would say stay back, and I would keep moving back. If I felt really threatened, that's when I would use. The know, pepper spray. The, yes. And there probably wouldn't be talk show couches behind you blocking your <laughs> right. way. And, a, and Howie. Uh, and a backup. <laughs> no, Howie Mandel would be there, probably. <laughs> 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 he would be there. Don't ask me why. Um, okay, let me ask you, uh, I've asked you a lot about uh, being the probation officer. Let me ask you about your job as, uh, you know, co-captain of, uh, of, of the cheerleading squad for the Bucks. okay? Yes. Here's what I'm curious about. Uh, something uh, bad happens on the field for the Bucks. okay? It's just something terrible. Uh, you know, a, a play goes badly. You're just, you're losing a big game. Do, do you cheer through something like that no. and try and pretend that it's not happening? No, we don't. Usually, if something bad, say we threw an interception, um, we, would, we would turn around, put our pom-poms behind our back. 
stand there. Pom-poms, <laughs> pom-poms behind your back yes. means not good. That's exactly what that means. I didn't know that. Do you have like a, a frowny face that you make no, in that we, situation? No, we, we try to keep the positive face, the smile going. The interview stance. You the, can do the interview that, stance. That would be our cheerleading interview stance. Right. <laughs> so the pom-poms behind you just right. means uh, this is not good. Right. Uh, now, uh, maybe you could uh, end our segment because we are out of time, but maybe you could end our segment with uh, maybe a cheer for this crowd right now so we could see you in action. I think that would be Absolutely. fun. Is that, is that all right? Would you do that? Do you want to lead our audience in a little cheer? I do. I do. All right. Okay. I would like this side of the audience, you're going to say, when I point to you, you're going to say, Conan. you got to be enthusiastic. I want to see you stand up. This side, you're going to say, O'Brien. Okay, are y'all ready? Why did you have to tell them? <laughs> why, did you have to t why did you have to tell them to be enthusiastic? <laughs> when you say yeah. Conan, look happy about it, all right? All right, uh, do your okay. stuff. Ready? Conan! That's the same trick that Mussolini used on the masses. <laughs> uh, uh, the Tampa Bay Buccaneers cheerleader, cheerleader swimsuit calendar uh, is available now. I just happen to own one. It's right here. We gave, it's Howie, available. One, we gave Howie one already. Howie has yeah. one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so Look at August. August. Yeah. August. <laughs> <laughs> Good Lord. Uh, Buccaneers. It's available at Buccaneers.com. And Lee, thanks so much for being here. Thank really you. nice talking to you. Yeah, Lee Killing, everybody. Kate Nash coming up. We'll be right back. I will, I'm ready. I will.